We're going to talk about how Rhythm can help you develop a great brand promise to win more of the right customers. What you want to do is first understand your core customer and position yourself to this person. This is a person. Now we live in a P2P world, a people to people world. Even you are a business to business company, it is still a person who buys from you and you need to understand that person who buys from you so that you can position to focus on their needs, what they must have versus what they would like to have. Let me show you IKEA. It's a great example. They know their core customer very well and they're able to build their stores and customer service is designed to deliver strongly to this core customer in a remarkable way. They do not try and position to everyone, just to the core customer because they really only want more of their core. So if you look at your brand promise, the question is, do you stand out from your competition when viewed by your core customer? because your brand promise should help you to win more of your core customers. Are you memorable to them? Uh, and one simple test is, are you actually making more sales with these customers? Okay, let me show you how Rhythm can help you uh, work on this. So if you go into Rhythm, uh, you wanna go to your brand promise, and if you're not sure or you're in somewhere else, you can click on the main menu under Think Strategic Plan, click on Brand Promise, and that's the first tab, Brand Promise. And so I'm gonna show you, gonna work on your core customer, their needs and their brand promise, right? You can click in any of these squares and you can type it out. I'm just giving you an example. This is an example of a core customer. And then you continue on to the needs and their brand promise. Hit save and you're good to go. Okay, now if you've been, after you've worked on the brand promise, you wanna now think of the right activities to deliver on your brand promise because the brand promise is not only about marketing it's also about you being able to deliver what you're promising so what are the right key activities for you to think about and how do you keep those promises how do you measure that I like to think of that as your KPIs in this case as your kept promise indicators and so in rhythm it is the same area and let me just bring back the rhythm screen so you can see what I'm referring to it's right down here so you click on your key activities and you can document that and you can click on how to measure and document it as well now again in collaboration you can come to attachments uh, you can actually then um, you can work on putting attachments here and if you can also work and collaborate with team members on the comments and your rhythm coach can also provide you with valuable insights as you're working on your brand promise okay and so that's how Rhythm can help you work through and think through your brand promise.